To access the activity editing options, you point to an activity, you hit the right mouse button, and it brings up the pop-up here that gives you all of the available options, for instance, copying activity, cutting activity, pasting, and so forth. But these are all individual activities, one at a time. A number of clients have been asking us specifically to be able to copy and move multiple activities at the same time. And obviously that's not available in the pop-up here. But the way it works, if you point at a particular activity, let's say the range stack here, I hold the control key down and I click on it. You'll see it highlights this in a kind of shaded effect. Mm -hmm. And then what you do is you go up to where you want the selection to end mm -hmm. and you click the item again. And you can see I've now highlighted multiple uh, chips here. And then what I can do, I can hit the right mouse button from here. And because it recognizes it's in this particular mode here, it then gives me these block options. So for instance, I could copy the block here and go to a particular location. Let's say I want to put it right here. I hit the right button on there. And you'll see now I've got an option here that says paste block. It's only there after you've copied a block, you'll get the paste block and it can insert it right in here. So you can see I've got the same three activities. The arrange, the clean up and the replenish is over here. Arrange, the clean up and the replenish here. So again, to select a particular group of items, you point at the first activity you're interested in. Let's say I was going to go for the second chip. I do a control click on it, I go to the one, the group end of the group I want to copy, I click on it again, I hit the right mouse button, and maybe I want to cut the block from here, so I can cut the block, it removes it, I can go somewhere else, let's say just over here, I hit the right button, and I can paste the block directly in there. Now, if you happen to select a few elements, let's say I select this one here, and I select up to here, and then you move to another one, you do anything off of this chip, the only thing you can do at this point is you can only hit the right button. If I move off of it, let's say I click on the secure four screws over here, these all deactivate again. So it's a, it's a contiguous action. Control click on the first one, control click on the last one. Then and only then can you hit the right mouse button and access the block, copy and cut options right here.